Hello everybody and welcome back to our tutorial On the previous video we used the design center to build our shafts and as, as he built them we have to change the name of these shafts in order to differentiate them so I'll right click and go to build of materials here okay model right click here and name it shaft 2 and click done and we have shaft 1 and shaft 2 okay if we go to bill of material here we have shaft two shafts and if we go to parts sometimes it won't be we can enable this one and we have shaft one and shaft two okay so the model data can I click here okay and replace shaft 1 replace ok close and the other shaft what is it this is shaft 1 and shaft 2 this one ok it's the same replace shaft 2 click ok replace and click close and click down and save now we'll go to when we'll go to our part list they'll be differentiated by shaft 1 and shaft 2 otherwise they'll be two pieces of shafts as named okay let's continue now we'll deal with our spur gears and again we'll go to design and go to spur gear and we have our dialog box here go to our drawings and see what we we need we need the ratio one module four angle pressure 21 center distance 60 We'll give it, we take a small, uh, here 61, but we'll give it as 60 and take it a little bit part because when uh, I put it as 60 and uh, drive it, I saw uh, the teeth, the mashing teeth are something wrong there. So I'll take the center distance to one millimeter apart. Face with 40 and we have the power of three kilowatt and for 5000 rpm so we'll go here and begin our design we we'll go to calculation I'll go to our geometry design let us uh, 3 kilowatt 5000 rpm okay and we'll have uh, 100,000 hours required lives okay calculate our module is 1 uh, sorry our ratio is 1 let us start with the cylindrical phase this one it will start the faces here the other cylindrical face is this one okay and the start plane is here sorry we'll start not not here okay against spur gears okay four and sixty distance okay 
we go to our calculation we have 3 kilowatt again 5000 here and 100,000 sorry okay design cylindrical face this one and starting face not the bottom we we'll start will start starting face here start plane yes the other one cylinder is this one and the start plane is the same okay so we have our gears 60 okay calculate we have some errors of course let us see what's the error here 20 okay 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 here we have some errors no we don't have any error calculation okay calculate we don't have any errors here let us uh, have some material okay we can go to check calculation and give material we go to ISO down okay and take uh, this one yes heated no we'll take multiple in this one normalize this click OK the other wheel it will be the same ISO and yes click OK click calculate design face width is 40 let us see what we have here uh, 15 million tax number of teeth is 15 yes everything is fine the error will be in the 60 and 61 okay I'll click OK now click OK accept what we have calculation design failure center distance and assembly is not sysmo let us edit and go to our calculation we have this and okay let us change it change the material ISO ISO we took what this one we took no we took normalize molybdene let us take uh, this one okay click OK the other one Mm -hmm. ISO eight hundred yes click OK calculate everything is fine now here everything is fine now only the center distance we have click OK and we have a center distance only it's not failed but it's fine okay accept so this is our something wrong with meshes as I told you I don't know what will happen I'll check it out and come back to you